This is uh, Russell Grant. Let's see if I can uh, grab a, a few words uh, with Russell. And welcome back to a brand new video. So, is that uh, Storm Bert has landed in uh, the UK and also in Blackpool? So uh, we're just near uh, Cleveland, and uh, hopefully there's a there's a light switch on. I'm not too sure if it's going to go ahead, but we can certainly um, certainly have a look at that one. And uh, yeah, so first of all, we're going to have a quick look at the uh, this sea because you can see it's a little choppy, and the high tide is about another hour from now. So we'll have a quick walk along the uh, this seafront, and then we'll get to the uh, the Christmas tree, and hopefully it's going to be uh, turned on by somebody very important. So come and join me. See uh, how fierce some of these uh, waves are, and like I said, high tide is about an hour's time. So you can imagine, you know, they're going to be uh, certainly crashing into the uh, into the wall. And uh, it's fantastic just uh, listening to the waves rolling in. So, like I said, you can see it's very, very like hazy. You can hardly see um, in through that, you know, a thousand meters in front of you, and it is very, very, very dark and hazy. You see the uh, we're going to lose the uh, the sunlight now, but yeah, like I said, we're going to head towards the uh, the Cleveland, and let's see if we can bring a bit of a uh, bit of warmth into this video. So we've just arrived in uh, Cleveland, right at the at the very top, and you can see the uh, the Christmas tree now is all lit up. And uh, one of my followers just uh, bumped into me, and he said, "Unfortunately, we, it's already been turned on." So that's a shame. So it looks like we've missed the uh, the turning on for uh, for the Christmas tree. So I'm a bit disappointed, really. But what we'll do, we'll have a, a bit of a look around Cleveland because that certainly looks fantastic. That's the tree. Let's have a, a quick look in all its uh, all its glory. And uh, look at that one. So yeah, what we'll do, we'll actually we'll have a, a bit of a look around Cleveland because it is quite busy um, on this day. So we'll uh, just pop. Uh, so it looks like there's a, a lot of groups happening near uh, near the Poundland. And uh, what a fantastic place Cleveland is! I've said this many times before, and it's certainly uh, certainly a place to be. And everyone's in uh, wonderful spirits. Look at this uh, snowman as well. Let's see if I can uh, get a bit of a shot with those two in. There we go. There we go. How lovely they look. <laughs> Hiya. You okay? Oh yeah, you all right? Oh, it's all right. I've, I just missed the switch on, haven't I? Yeah. Oh, what a shame. Yeah, uh, um, just a glance over here. Oh, which one's Russell Grant? Uh, he's wearing the green, where, where it says Pepco. This is uh, Russell Grant and Jane, who uh, do a fantastic job in uh, Cleveland. I wonder if we can... Uh, I think I might be able to get a couple of words out of him. It's quite a dark, actually, the light. And, uh, This is uh, Jane from uh, Cleveland, and she does all the volunteer group, and what an amazing job she does as well. <laughs> really? 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 So yeah, fantastic day. Like I said, keep up the great work, and everybody appreciates you. I know, it's all the little hats and everything when you decorate. <laughs> How are you doing alright? Yeah, we won the King's Award for Voluntary Service last week. It's absolutely fantastic, the, the things you do. Yeah. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> so, and are you part of it as well? Yeah. Oh, brilliant. I'll grab you, uh, grab you in. <laughs> Just all my viewers, obviously, you know, the amazing job, the amazing work you do. The Blackpool ads. The Blackpool ads here on YouTube. And, uh, fantastic work. So, brilliant. <laughs> I know, it does. This is uh, Russell Grant. Let's see if I can uh, grab a, a few words uh, with Russell. Thank you for coming out on such a terrible day. 
Russell, Hello, how are you how doing? Are you? I'm not too bad yourself. We've seen you on YouTube. Oh, do you? We've seen you trotting around. The last yeah. time I saw you was by the North Pier. Right. When you were wandering around because all the police were there. Oh, yeah, one of the. Was uh, that a couple of months ago. It was, yeah. Ago? Yeah, I've been in and out of hospital as I was. Oh, say. dear. But there we are. Oh, we're I, back. And we're back. It's a lovely place to be. I went to Cleveland. It must have been about two or three days ago. I've been here quite a few times. Everybody said, how lovely it is all the little woolen mittens and the and the, the volunteer shops. groups in the, the shops. shops it's like i remember yeah a town center used to be yeah and that's what makes it so much it is it's something special yes yeah. it's, it's really it nice really is. yeah so i'm delighted to be here today thanks to jane for inviting me to switch on the light oh and i just missed it i thought it was about four o'clock ten past four and i Did just missed it earlier then i think they might have done yeah a few oh, minutes earlier by jane. oh of course, but the <laughs> oh, lovely to meet you anyway, and, you. and take care you of yourself. What you do. Thank you. Take care. Bye bye. Bye. Yeah. Hi. And how lovely was it to meet uh, Russell Grant? You can see all the uh, wonderful volunteers. Let's even get a, a couple of uh, a bit of a shots, and all these do an absolutely amazing job. All these in the uh, the high vis, all volunteers of Cleveland. Uh, what an amazing job they all do. Absolutely uh, incredible. So I think what we'll do, we'll have a, a few, bit of a walk down. We'll see there's plenty of uh, decorated trees and all sorts. So we'll have a walk down and uh, just see some of the work this group has done. So this is the, uh, the high street. And uh, it's, it's wonderfully decorated, like I keep mentioning. And there's a little clock tower here with uh, the lights. Well, unfortunately, we just missed the switch on. I thought it was around 4 o'clock. It might have been... They might have done it slightly early because of the storms coming in, or it could be me just getting the, uh, the times completely wrong. But nevertheless, we met some of the uh, wonderful volunteers, Jane, and uh, yeah, the, 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 obviously the famous Russell Grant. And you can see, you know, I say these all wonderfully decorated. Look at this one. How fantastic does that look? You know, the clock tower just at the uh, just at the top. See, they got the, uh, just taking the, uh, the stalls in, last of the stalls. And again, you know, we, we filmed it here just a couple of days ago. And uh, again, it was like a, a nighttime one, really. But yeah, some uh, wonderful shops. And we did pop into the, uh, the corkscrew. That was uh, very swishing there. And uh, we did say we'll pop back um, to the little uh, shop next door, uh, the little uh, retro cafe bar. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll probably do that another day. You see, it's wonderfully decorated. So you see all the uh, all the lights, uh, even on the uh, the plants. You can see, you know, another one. There, look at that. Looked after by a uh, coastal community team. So, like I said, a very special, very special place, Cleveland. And so, you know, even uh, even as you know, like I said, the little plants here, even those have uh, decorated. Let's have a look to the uh, left-hand side. You see all the uh, wonderful independent shops, all uh, all open. And you know, how rare do you even get little uh, independent card shops? Got occasions, like I said, there's many, many. Fantastic shops in Cleveland. So uh, even Cleveland has a, a bit of a nightlife, and that's the uh, the Glass House, just located on the corner, and that's a, a great cocktail uh, bar and bistro. So like I say, if you are in Cleveland, you fancy that late drink, you can always pop into that. And that certainly looks a, a nice one. And what a, what a fitting place to uh, to end the video um, for tonight is the uh, the Clock Tower. Uh, right at the top of Cleveland, and uh, you can certainly see how well decorated that one is. So we'll have a, a quick look around, and that is uh, amazing. All to do with the uh, the Christmas. You see, it's multicolored. It changes colour, and how lovely is that? That is. Uh, let's move the camera up a little bit. There we go. Get it in shot, and that is something spectacular. Like I said, you know, again. 
care for Cleveland's uh, and Jane and all the other volunteers run this group to, uh, to bring Cleveland's and uh, put it onto the map, so to speak. So I'll have a little shot, pan the camera right round and uh, that's the, uh, the main high street of Cleveland's right down there and it is uh, wonderfully, wonderfully decorated. So I think we'll, uh, we'll end on a, a bit of a shot near the sea because uh, I know a lot of people do like to uh, just to take the views in, listen to the waves crashing. And uh, Stormbird, like I said, has landed in Blackpool. You see the tower right in the very distance. Look at a little tiny pinprick right in the distance. And you see how rough the, uh, the sea is. But what a, what a place Cleveland is. If you haven't visited, certainly come to Cleveland. It's magnificent. And until next time, take care of yourselves. Here's a bye from me. If you haven't already subscribed, consider hitting the subscribe button. Uh, we do try to bring you all sorts of content. No matter what the weather, hit the like button. And any comments, I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. And until next time, take care and stay safe.